Hey there squeegee slingers and you water fed pole wiggling wagglers. Thank you for tuning in, much appreciated. Today we're going to be talking about how to clean your applicators and flick pads, those cleaning items that when you press that up against the glass, you want it looking fairly decent. You don't want your customers thinking, ugh, that's cleaning my glass. So let's go and have a look how I clean my applicators and flick pads. Okay then folks, so just follow me around, we've got the hose connected up here, okay, so uh, let's follow that round, got the extension cable, and here is the thing that I use, this is the Karcher K2 pressure washer, tiny little thing, I uh, got this for under £100, so I use this to clean the flick pads and applicators, you'll probably find yourself, if you're putting your applicators and things into the washing machine, they never really seem to come out 100%, you know, you always get left with a bit of black, and uh, just ingrained dirt that never seems to really come off. So you can have a look at the applicators just now, and you'll see that it's a bit, uh, it's a bit black. There's a bit of dirt on there. Get them nice and cleaned up. These ones are looking a little bit yellowy. Um, there's a lot of pollen going around just now. So I'm going to clean all this off, and it's going to look like brand new again. So it's just a pressure washer. There's no additives or soaps or anything like that. Just straight water from the tap and give it a blast. So uh, let's crack on and get this done, shall we? So as you can see guys, it turns out nicely back to the original colour again. So it was looking a little bit like that, you can see that applicator there, it looks a bit black as opposed to this. Yeah? What do you think? Leave your comments and suggestions in the box below how you guys like to do it. But personally I find this nice, quick and easy and it turns it right back to the colour it should be. So happy days. Let's crack on and get this applicator done shall we? As you can see, my patio looks like it needs a bit of a clean as well. It's went from that colour to that. So, whoops, showing up myself here. But uh, let's flip this over so you'll see the difference. So that's what it is now after being cleaned, as opposed to that kind of black looking yellowy stuff that's on there as well. So That's what we like to see. Look at that. B E A beautiful. Yeah, you can see that sort of yellowy stuff on there, it's all pollen. Let's get that off, shall we? Look at all that soap, boys. Lovely jubbly. And last but not least, ugh. I mean look at the difference guys, look at the colour difference. Awesome. Don't say I'm not good to you, eh? sharing all my trade secrets. Ah, 
And there we have it guys. Back to brand new again. So hopefully you've enjoyed that guys. And that's my top tip for cleaning your applicators and flick pads and getting them looking nice and clean and like brand new again. And your customers will be happy that you're putting a nice clean applicator on their window and not some dirty old rag looking thing. We don't want that. So thanks very much for tuning in guys. Remember to smash that like button and subscribe. Be much appreciated. And until next time, I'll see you later. Bye for now.